Hey, this is Dream Manning. Welcome to Dollar in a Dream. Whoa, is this why I sound like in my head? Weird. Butt farts. Butt farts. Wet sponge. Wow, you sound like a 23-year-old white guy from Pennsylvania. Trust the process. I like it. I want to talk to you guys about script writing. So, a lot of my friends and peers have been struggling with this lately, and I'm not gonna lie, once upon a time, I did too. When I first started writing scripts, I felt like I had to do this whole industry standard thing. The proper grammar, the proper way of lining everything up, the whole industry standard. I never thought I could put my own, like, personal twist into it. After reading tons of books, blogs, articles, even, like, rough Hollywood scripts, I thought, you know, fuck that. If I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it my way. This isn't for the person that's like stuck in the whole traditional way or trying to figure out Do I use Final Draft or Celtics? I don't know, which is better? <laughs> this is for the person who doesn't know the difference between like a slug line and a slug line. This is for the person who's way too consumed to figure out how to do it the correct way. The only and best way to tell a story is to simply tell it. Don't worry about Hollywood styles or industry standards. If you're still living in your parents' basement or trying to figure out what's for dinner, ramen or steak, the only industry standard I know is a beginning, middle, and end. If you want to focus on something, focus on character development. Focus on making them a three-dimensional being. Focus on making the world around them really feel real. Make the characters in the world jump off the page. You know, fuck that. No. Make the characters real. Make the world real. That's the only thing that makes a story worth reading. Oh, you don't know what software to use? Here's a whole list for you set to nice, relaxing music. Celtics. Dramatica. Dubscript. Fade in professional screenwriting software. Boy, that was a mouthful. Final Draft. Jotterpad Pro. Montage Software. Movie Magic Screenwriter. Page 2 Stage. Practical Scriptwriter. Script Studio. Scripts Pro. Scrivener. Scrivener. Scri- Whatever it is. Trelby. Writer Duet. Or you could just, you know, do the whole normal thing and, you know, good old fashioned pencil and paper. Not having the right software or following the whole industry standard is like a load of bullshit. Quentin Tarantino is one of my favorite directors, and the way he writes his scripts is a novel formation. And honestly, this is something that's totally frowned upon by producers, but you know what? Let's be honest. With the current track record of Hollywood, do you really want to trust those people with your baby? Yeah. If you have a passion to create and drive to push your screenplay into production, that's all you need. Yeah, your first scripts are going to be complete shit. That's just honestly how it's going to be. And that's fine. As long as you continue to write and continue to progress, everything else is going to be rudimentary. There are so, so many, many stories, stories right, in right in front of us. We just have to put the pen to paper and tell them. The industry standard isn't more important than your creativity. Don't trade away your creativeness for standard. Make your creativeness the new standard. Break boundaries and create greatness. My name is Dre Manning. This is Dollar in a Dream. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. As always, none of this matters if you don't go out there and apply it. Just go shoot your shot.